Way to stay in the ropes. David hasn't thrown. There's a right hand. Two good right hands. The left hook here in the first round. Just something we haven't seen. From time to time, you'll see the idea of Bochy take out because of the fact that Glitch Gockman and Tyson and tonight to take on one of those champs for the world title. Remember, two of the reigning heavyweight champions of the world today. David is able to get into this guy, and it's going to spell some tremendous sparring for this without losing his patience. Las Vegas, Nevada, and the campus, David Tua. David's got his hands high, digs to the body with a body. David knows what it's like to have a boxer than Lewis. But... No heavy breathing from David yet. First round. His left shoulder away while stepping to the right. The spinning motion of Bird. Low. Slick straight right hand. Wherever you're watching around the world, the big this sporting event is for all of you. To the noggin. Another good shot by, like the old David Tua right here. But he has. David digs a body shot. Bird just slips away. That sneaky shot. David not afraid to take it. The judges are going to give it to Chris Bird. David trying to walk him down, trying to get inside, right in front of him. He's not getting any angles. Not David. David, you heard what Joe Goosen said in between rounds. Bird just wants to catch the left of David. Because every time he catches it, David can't believe you me. He's aware of it. Nice combination by him. No power. Just trying to feel where he is. This is a big mistake for Bird to stand flat footed here. Nice to fight as you look at the lead for the side. Jeff Wooden uh, back in before the one minute. Our, I'm Bob Sheridan. Glad that you can be with it. the world. Glad that David Tua in the blue trunks. Digs to too much of the body. A digging shot to the solar plex. Real good body shot by David. Another digging body shot below the elbow. It's the punch. Bird showing his hand speed. David willing to take it. Going. He's pouring with his left hand. He's so used to throwing that left hook with such the right hand he loads it up pretty good pace to this he can unleash the right hand goes to the left hand missed a big shot but came back with a pretty strong right hand Late. david goes with his straight and he slid. david doesn't seem to mind getting to turn your back like you're doing but perhaps you don't read up his right side but it's showing you the fight look at the combination by david he's a powerful guy because you have to have effective aggressiveness It's kind of a self of the book. Maybe. Is that straight uh, left? Thinking body shots again. Something that was lacking before. This is something that's not finished. Digging to the body. You see him turn his body away. Watch the power here. The power then. Watch the combinations. Watch it right here. There you go. Just working on this. Is as I can. The old... As a matter of fact, the way the fight is going to In the fourth round, an eye socket of Chris Bird. Please say, keep that hand closed. To David with his right hand, and then punch with his... And that's what... Don't let him out, he's saying. Keep him in there. The way to do... Digging, digging shot to the rim. Good shot by... Pull David down. Here... Caught David with him as Bird walks away, sneaky shot inside. This is a tough round of score. Judges warning about the head. This is round. So already, you two is a better fighter than most. Because that left hand gets through by Bird again. There's a left hand into the ropes. David tries to catch him out again. He didn't quite catch Bird more than a... And he's in the top ten, and everybody's fight is right now. Is that it's, now watch him come forward. Now watch the escape. Boom, inside. And then he runs around with hand. Okay to catch and okay to turn. An open hand. You got a close goal with some of these shots. That girl, you know, it's David, of course, one of 15 ranked fighters. David is actually fighting wild left hooks. But where the, the whole team told him. So there's no panic. This, I can outbox David to him. That's what they're going to the fight, Chris Burr. Nobody will take the chance. It's a matter of time that his power catches up throw the right with them straight right hand you want this is a nice fight and a former wbo champion without being pretty darn good remember there's a 19 pound weight disadvantage for bird and david's trying to take advantage of it in here look at that with uh, the it's david's job inside the ring in the blue trunk david david throwing all right and has 
Joe Goosen was saying, move your head back. The fact that Bert holds his arm so hard to do it, too. But nonetheless, for all those reasons, a low blow is a low blow. Real nice combination. Nice uppercut inside. Really unloaded. There it is. It crashes a bit. A bird, but you got to say, bird's in pretty good shape. That was a pretty good left hook. Not David's best. Bird's only been down a couple times in his career. As I looked down at my notes, he's only been down one. Being Gucci, when he was down in the fifth or sixth round, I think it was the fifth round he got knocked out in that fight. You see, it's clearly right up, right there. Movement here again. Watch this. Watch Bird. Boom, boom, boom around, and he spins David around. That's frustrating to David. And you know, in this round number seven, from left. Lightning, left hand, Don't power shot. Right left hook. That's the first time we've seen it. Is that frustration or is it time to put the lights on? That's the along with that 233 pounds. And it's ridiculous. He also weighed 245 in fights, and he came into this one at 233. Digging body shot up there. Many more right hands by David. He hasn't caught him quite flush yet. But David, he hit all rights in this fight by David. He's and this is a 12-round fight. Have got to begin to kill as a flat-footed guy back on his heels, still throwing a lot of stuff, mainly in David's case. Uh, there's probably a minimum of five. It's a profession. Prize money's all about money at this level. To get David financially secure, so he doesn't have to worry about that thing. In the ring. And I'll tell you what, like the two professional judges, and that's going to be... You know, the way this fight's going to come down is, unless it's a knockout, which most people expect. Oh, David nailed him with a nice off. David holds it in, just as he said, but look at that. Trying to load up either a left hook or a right hand. Loaded, I can see it in his face, and he wants to roll the same one. Left hand gets through by Bird. Bird coasting now, back in the ropes. Throws his quarter of punches. With all those punches he landed, David just said, come on, throw some more. Pick up some big bomb. David's looking to throw it. He's just taunting him now. But David's totally under control. He's inviting him to come to him. David's stepping back for the first time, inviting him to up a shot. He expended a light. Oh. By Bird. Bird now catching him from the Detroit and Clinton, Michigan area. Here's some on Skybox office in New Zealand. Right to the lower part of the left rib. Set up for a power shot. Even the left hand. Right hand was there that time. And he couldn't yoke off the fight this time. David leads forward, Bates loads up the right hand. Bird catches it on the back. I don't know, I think I gotta give that round to David because of the heavy blow early going. He Look at this. The hand for Bird with four rounds. Bucci unable to pull that out. And it wasn't a, and a very close fight, but it's attention. Nobody wants to fight. Fight a visible mistake. Between three and four points. A minute to go in this round. It's a key round. Looks to be in tremendous condition as well. He's not really huffing and puffing, and he's working hard too. He's just flat out boxing David too. Six Lewis people at this stage who really don't want to fight this guy. Full 12 rounds, so it's no disgrace. The only difference. Guy down was I could be a Bucci. Who gave David Fitz a couple of years ago, as you know. David having a good round now. He's winning this round, and as I say that, that's really good job. And this is what I mean about Art Bach. You can see why a little guy in boxing won a great job in the heavyweight. Good. One to either side of the head here. Rockman, one of the heavyweight champs. Fight. Nice left hook. I'm Bob Sheridan, glad you can be with us. All over the Pacific Rim. Bird, straight left again, gets it's clear he can't outbox him. 15 minutes, 17 to go in the 10th round. Bird continues to outbox him. David really has the instructions of Joe Cusimano. Loads up the right hand, but it doesn't quite get Chris Bird. It looks like a little wobbly there. For a second. David's back. The 
10th round. Bates left, Bates right, Bob's down. Bird comes through, David misses. Misses with the uppercut. David tries to hot dog it just a little bit. And there's the end of the... Talk about some action here. Card 97 95, and these are part of the reasons why David missing desperation shots here. A little slip that time. Here we go, round 11. David, too, is running out of time. Hello, in their prediction. David unleashed a vicious shot. Too late for that now. David's got to go ahead on it. Just beside each other, you're lacking in power. Almost like David, that didn't bother me. And that's been the problem with both guys with the, they've ever fought for it. Targets to go, but David to score. Tries to come off the ropes. Maybe they can get a second win. David crushes him behind the head with that shot. David's winning this round now. Loads up the right hand. Look at the hand speed. A bird coming off the ropes. David is going to be frustrated. As David with that big left hook at the bell, and that one did for Chris Bird, and it's David until the last two or three rounds, but David's been able to go in. Bird has terrific fourth pitching. He's fighting a brilliant fight. Which the judges might have it a little bit differently. Again, the judging determines where the guys combination to Bird. Minute 40 seconds. Where's that big left? Come up frustrated, but he hasn't been able to shift this guy at all. Loads up the right hand. Seen a lot of good things by David. His conditioning is fed up to the one minute remaining mark. The guy is going to leave much of the table this fight. David went out. Forty seconds. Wow! Been frustrated by the fact he can't land a big shot tonight. Look at this. David giving it his all right to the bell. There's the bell. David's bent over. And look at the way David comes out of it. Look at the way Chris Bird's able to cover up, slide away, avoid the punch. And now the mandatory challenger for the IBF heavyweight crown.